Hi, my name is Joanna Schofield and I'm a graduate student at Kent State University. I am currently working towards my master's in library and information science, focusing on children's and young adult librarianship. This presentation is a short introduction to the life and accomplishments of a beloved children's author, Tommy DePaola. For more information on his life or books, please check out his website, www.tommy.com, my blog, or any of the additional resources located at the end of this presentation. Tommy DePaola was born on September 15, 1934 in Connecticut. His family is half Irish and half Italian. He grew up in Connecticut with his Irish mother, his Italian father, his older brother Buddy, and his younger sisters Judy and Maureen. His mother read to him often as a young child, which is where his love of reading and books began. He also fell in love with theater and dancing at a young age. Later in life, he would fulfill two of his lifelong dreams, publishing a book and tap dancing on stage. After high school, DePaula attended art school at Pratt Institute in Brooklyn, New York. Years after his graduation, he received his first publishing contract illustrating a science book called Sound. After that, he began writing and illustrating his own books, and has now illustrated almost 250 books and written over 100 of those. He is best known for his autobiographical work, such as Nana Upstairs and Nana Downstairs, and his Dragonona series. He has also published numerous other picture books and many holiday and religious works as well. In particular, he has published numerous picture books about Catholic saints and the Christmas story. DePaula has received many awards and recognitions during his lifetime. Some highlights include the 1976 Caldecott Honor Award for Streganona, the 2000 Newbery Honor Award for 26 Fairmont Avenue, the 2011 Laura Ingalls Wilder Award, and the 1999 Living Treasure Award, which is a New Hampshire Governor's Arts Award. He has also been awarded eight honorary doctorate degrees. They include Colby Sawyer College, New Hampshire, St. Anselm College, New Hampshire, Notre Dame College in New Hampshire, Emerson College in Massachusetts, the University of Connecticut, Georgetown University in Washington, D.C., New England College in New Hampshire, and most recently, the Pratt Institute in New York. So, what is Tommy DePaola doing now? According to his website and blog, he is living and working in New London, New Hampshire, in a remodeled 200-year-old barn with his beloved dog, Bronte. For more information about Tommy DePaola, please look at these digital and print resources. Thank you so much for your attention. If you have additional questions or comments, please feel free to contact me via my blog or at jschofi4 at kent.edu. Thanks and have a wonderful day.